Hello everybody and welcome back to Advanced Maths. Today we're looking at constructions, angular bisectors. This is my second video on constructions. I did a video on perpendicular bisectors and I'm going to do another video on drawing equilateral triangles uh, next. So make sure you check those videos out as well. Now, when we're doing constructions, we use a compass, a ruler and a pencil to draw accurate drawings. There's a little reminder of how to use a compass here, which I covered in the last video. Uh, so I'm not going to waste any more time repeating that again. But feel free to watch the video on perpendicular bisectors if you want a quick reminder. Now an angular bisector is when we have an angle already drawn for us and we want to split it in half. And so we start by taking our compass and we draw an arc around the point of the angle. Remember you have to put the needle of the compass perfectly on top of the point of the angle. Now we have uh, two points where it crosses over and we're going to do two arcs around that. So we're doing one uh, arc around this point over here and we're going to do another arc around this point over here. When you're doing this, don't adjust your compass. Keep it the exact same distance. If it slips, you need to start again. Uh, because you need all of these uh, lines here to be the exact same distance away from each other. Now we're going to take our ruler and we're going to draw a line from the angle to this new point where these two arcs overlap. Like this. And that is our angular bisector. That should be exactly halfway. But we can, what we can do is check by measuring these two angles. We can measure this angle and it's 50 degrees. Half of that will be 25 and we measure the other angle and it will be 25 degrees. So it's a really easy way to check if you have your protractor for measuring angles available. You can practice this yourself by drawing an angle on a piece of paper and bisecting it and then checking that you've done it right with your protractor. Thanks for watching today's video. Remember to watch the video on perpendicular bisectors and equilateral triangles, and also like and subscribe for more videos. There are more videos helping you with all of secondary maths uh, coming straight up uh, week after week. Good luck in your exams, and I'll see you in the next video.